Hi there, my name is Joshua Ashthorn, and welcome to Milk Inside a Bag of... In, uh, milk in... Milk Inside a Bag of Milk Inside a Bag of Milk. I have absolutely no idea, but this game has a sequel, so I'm playing the first one. Help me buy milk. Okay. Write down your name. I'm on my way to the store. Rehearsing... Yeah, that's rehearsing. I almost read that. Rehearsing the speech. I haven't been out for so long that I've forgotten what words they say when they enter the store. I'm on my way to the store. Uh, who are you talking to? I imagine being a game character. What if it helps to gather my thoughts? What game? Well, you know... There are games in which you see characters' thoughts right on the screen, you know? So I thought, if someone reads my thoughts, then I have to be really con concentrated so <laughs> as to not whip up the extra. Haha. <laughs> Yikes, I should have started reading before I started recording. I'm deeply breathing in. Hello, can I? Uh... Damn, I forgot. 19th attempt, and I'm failing again. I bite my lips with annoyance. So once again... Hello, can I get? <laughs> wow, a whole word more! Thank you, I'm trying really hard. In my opinion, this will be the one... This will... Oh, this time the one sound was longer than usual. No, that's an I. That's not a one. It looks like a one. Yikes. Do you think this is it? Who knows? Oh, that... Okay, so it's an L, so I was wrong altogether. Hello, can I? Ugh, I'd better keep my lips sealed. Haha, <laughs> loser! <laughs> Don't worry. Okay. By the way, you've been walking with your left foot on asphalt and your right foot on the grass the whole minute. What? My right leg froze in the air. How much? 50 steps on asphalt and 51 on grass. You will have to cancel the previous step. Hehehe. <laughs> what? How do you imagine it? This is not the first time. You were taught how to do it. Come on. I... I don't remember. I'm going to burst into tears. Uh, from the beginning. So, step one, take a step back to get your foot exactly into your own trail. Wait, wait, how is it step one? What then? So it's already the 52nd. But wait, if I'm going backwards, then 50th. It still doesn't make a lot of sense. Okay, okay. Step 50th. Take a step back to your foot. What? To your foot exactly in your trail. Why am I reading this so horribly today? Like, I apologize for that. Could you paraphrase it at least a little? You can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. Well, apparently I don't fucking read, so... Apparently people do talk like that. You're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. The store closes in an hour, so you'll be very, very guilty if you do not buy milk. Damn, really? So, are you ready? Yes, yes. Or it's yes, yes. I don't know. I gently change the position of the leg, peering carefully into the thick grass. And here I try to read horror stories. Yikes. When I entered the store, I asked the very first person I met. Hello, can I? What the hell is that? Uh, oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Uh, 
Okay, I really don't want to yell into my mic right now. Oh, excuse me, what? Oh! <laughs> You'd better not do it. He is clearly not going to change his lines. You run the risk of falling into the endless loop. Excuse me, what? Yeah, that's my question. Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. What? Oh. What is he trying to tell you? He's trying to scare me. But how does he know that I'm terrified by the letter O? <laughs> what is so terrible about it? I have a frightening image as soon as I imagine it. I can show, explaining won't be enough, but... Oh. Um, something like that. So I'll just keep on ignoring his question. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> I gather all the will into a fist. Oh? Oh! I got an achievement. Oh! <laughs> My interlocutor... What? My something shook and crawled. I actually don't know that word. I've never seen that. You just repeated after him. And it worked. Do it more often. Wait, I said that he crawled, but did he really crawl? Because I didn't even look in his direction. When exactly did you say that? Yeah, just now. Personally, I didn't hear it. I read it. You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. Oh, how meta. I'm standing by the shelves. On the shelves, there are bags of milk. Excuse me? The two of us are standing. And milk lies? Or maybe... Hey, hey, slow down. Do you even remember why we came? Oh, excuse me. To buy milk. So buy. Right here? How, in your opinion, should I reply? Hmm, I suppose something like, not here? Okay, not here. Take the bag and go to the cash desk. I guess the first sentence. And you like for spite, like for spite didn't make a pause before the second one. When I take away all my small victories, I sigh and put my hand and I sigh and pull my hand to take milk, or rather a bag of milk inside. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag of milk. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside. Reception, reception! Fifteen minutes before sto store closing, hurry up! I remembered what these games are called. Visual novels! And by the way, the numbers on the... The numbers are written there in full, in letters. Are visual novels worse than books? But authors are not lazy there, and you don't be lazy too. Oh my god, some of this writing hurts me. And my reading hurts me. I need to stop complaining about that. Wait, I thought your only thoughts were visible on the screen. I thought only your thoughts were visible on the screen. Not anymore, so watch your language, hee <laughs> hee. Ahem. Anyway, you heard me. Hurry up or there'll be no going... No good at home. There'll be no going home either. Already running! Hello? Can I get milk, please? What the hell are you? You have it. Ah. Give. I put out a weighty bag of... I put out the weighty bag at the pay desk. Of course, not just a bag, but milk too. Hello, can I get it back, please? No. Please. No. But please, Mom will throw me out of the window if I get back without milk. No. Fuck you, E.T. But why not? Give more. I don't have anything else. 
Hey. What? Pay for the milk. <laughs> really? What would I do without you? I pull a crumpled a crumpled cash, yep, out of my pocket and give it to the cashier. He starts to carefully examine it. About two days have passed before the <laughs> before he nodded satisfactorily. Satisfactorily. Yes. And put a cash. Put a cash. Yep, I am okay. So it's fucking with my head, right? In the machine. Put a cash in the machine. I'm not editing out these mistakes. I'm not. Thank you. Goodbye. Okay. <laughs> I'm walking down a familiar street past a gas station. A bag of milk unpleasantly pulls away my hand, reminding me of the times I took physical therapy. What? By the way, they gave me a bag at the pay machine, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk inside another bag. Don't get me wrong, I just like the pyramidal structure of verbal constructions. I don't. A gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Thanks for your interest, I feel like a mile of ice cream. Like, you could eat a mile of ice cream, or you are a mile of ice cream. What is that supposed to mean? As if I tell you. But I'm interested. Well, look, the ratio of water to milk in the volume of air com occupied by me is about 30 to 1. I agree, it's not the tastiest ice cream, unless you want to drink more than to eat. So, the way from the store to the gas station is a stick, and the way from the gas station to home is ice cream. For today's walk, my body will be in every part of this way. Simple math. What? I feel movement under my feet. Asphalt grains. Petrol stains. That sounds like a, like a rock song. I'm trying to keep my balance, and how do people move on something as uneven as urban plain? Neat heel sock. Neat heel sock? What? I count every meter of the way I've gone. I even close my eyes for more constant concentration. Hey, watch out! Huh? I unconsciously take a sharp step aside. At the same moment, a huge bear sweeps past me with a wild ripple. Hey, I'm walking here! I'm throwing a stumbling peek at the rapidly moving animal. Its red eyes, in turn, look at me with mockery. Did you see that? How brazen! It was a truck. Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears with eyes on the back of their head? You might have died. Come on, are you saying someone will seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? The world is cruel and dangerous. I'm not in the world you're talking about. I'm kind of glad you're not. Wait, so we've been walking literally on the road the whole time? My path continues. If you think about it, the way from the store has one interesting property. In the most bizarre ways, it adjusts to me. When I hurry, all traffic lights are servicefully extinguished. <sighs> When I want to cry, a cloud appears and pours rain flows that hide my tears. Right now, I feel how the cloud is slowly gathering over my top. I'm sad. Are you sure all of this is really happening? And how else? Have you never been visited by the idea that all this is only happening in your head? The instruction did not say that at all. Apparently, these pills don't work on me, either. Dots. You know what? What? Since I am a character in a visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading it right now. This can affect... This can affect on your recovery in a wrong way. I don't care. Do you hear it? I squeeze my head with the hands and set a thought bat block. I squeeze my head with the hands and set a thought block. Christ. With the edge of my eye, I notice a small bench. A great place for cliched visual novels monologues. 
I'm getting closer, putting a noticeably heavy bag of milk nearby and raising my head to the sky. Dots. Listen. I'm a little embarrassed, huh? I understand I'm going crazy. Drugs are working less and less effectively, so... Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you understand what I'm talking about? Yeah. Really? I must be quite unlike an exem exemplary protagonist, right? To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Well, apparently I haven't either. Sometimes I regret it, because now I need a lot of effort just to distinguish letters and words. By the way, if you don't mind, I wouldn't like to say my diagnosis. My diagnoses. Let at least you be the one who sees me as I am. Even if I made you up, don't take it away from me, okay? Don't ask me about too much. How stupid is all this? From the very beginning you followed me, read my delusional thoughts, heard my stupid conversations. Maybe I seem crazy and weird to you? <laughs> what is it like to see the world within my eyes? Ever since, ahem, something happened, I only see red everywhere. No, don't worry about me, I've just been... I've been used to it for a long time. To be honest, I even forgot what other colors look like. Do you see, like, pixels and shit, too? Let it go. Those monsters from the store, they didn't scare me at all, because I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think they're the ones who are scared. Can you imagine it? By the way, if you want to ask me what happened, please don't. Do you promise? Sure. I'm serious. Well, okay, I should have said yes. Of course you couldn't not ask. Wait, what? You couldn't not to ask. In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I would have raised this topic. So, you're really wondering what happened to me? Yeah, sure, why not? I won't take time. What do you see? I don't know. <laughs> Are you sure? I think it's going to be the same response no matter what. One way or another... Actually, I think that looks like Sonic the Hedgehog. Is this Sonic.exe? This is my dad. Some of his parts, at least. Oh, shit. I don't see that at all. We do have a very difficult family. But despite all the problems, I would never have thought. Thought what? Sorry, I shouldn't have raised my voice. It's not how I read it. In general, he threw himself out the window and died. Oh, shit. This is my last memory. Then, a long gap. Strange. Very strange. Today's the first time I've been able to buy something from a store without a serious incident. Of course, the medicine helped me, however... I think it's more of your merit. I was thinking all the time, do not screw up in front of the reader, or... Oh my god, what will he think? <laughs> I don't know why I decided to become a character in a visual novel for the sake of going to the store today, but... It's clearly born fruit. Thank you. By the way, I think there are some frameworks in our communication. That's how I like it. And yet, I'm so sad lately. I think more and more about what my life has become ever since Dad. Well, you understand. Day after day is the same. I've tried so many pills that I can't feel difference between any any of them anymore. As long as they keep me on my feet, I'm happy. <laughs> but you know what? Today's a special day because I have you. I want to tell you... Because I have you. I want to tell you so much. So Why does it do that?
What, what do you say? Like, I'm, I'm scrolling to get, like, back and shit, but it's not letting me... It was very rude of you to what? What? You... Okay, special day... It was very rude of you. Oh, no. I will not press you. I just advise you. Go home. What? I understand. Well, dear reader, let's go. What? What was very rude? I, I don't understand. I stop on the floor and hang by the railing. Well, then again, I don't understand this game in the slightest so far. Repeating this action every day, like a ritual, I stopped being afraid of heights. A few minutes ago, the pills finally came to naught, so I'm just enjoying blissful silence. While I'm under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head. Mixing with the sounds of the world around me, they create a terrible dissonance in my head. I turn around and go to my apartment. How high up is this shit? I mean, it's gotta be pretty high up if you can just jump from it and lose body parts. Hi! Did you bring milk? Hi, Mom. Did you bring milk? Yes, Mom. Did your new medicine help? Yes, Mom. Go to bed. Yes, Mom. Well, was that it? Oh, yeah, okay, yeah, that was it. Well, um, that was interesting. <laughs> I was not expecting what we got, in all honesty. Oh, what is this? Okay. Okay, so I can't go back to... Oh, wait, can I? Yes. All right. So, I have absolutely no effing clue what just happened. But I plan on playing the sequel to this. <laughs> so... <laughs> Hopefully the next one makes more sense. Um... But yeah, that was milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag of milk with also milk inside a bag that is also in another bag, which also contains milk. Uh, <laughs> if you enjoyed, don't forget to like, subscribe, and all that nonsense, and hopefully next time I can effing read. I'll catch you in the next one. See ya!